Today, we've got a 1300 horsepower formula drift car using a 3D printed wide body kit. This is good. So the formula drift champion, Chris Forsberg, has used 3D printing to create a custom wide body kit for his Nissan Altamaniac, a 1300 horsepower twin turbo V6 powered monster designed to shred through tires in the formula drift championship. Now, if you're familiar with the racing series or just love car builds, you may remember Chris Forsberg as one of the creators behind Ryan Turk's V8 Ferrari powered Toyota GT4586. Now Forsberg wanted a wide body kit inspired by the sleek and wide bodywork of DTM cars over in Europe. And as you may have figured out, uh, not many DTM style body kits exist for the current generation of Nissan Altima or pretty much any family sedan for that matter. So Forsberg and his team turned to tech consulting to create the custom body kit using 3D scanning to create CAD models of the body work. And from there, they designed and printed out the wide body kit in sections and then glued them all together. It looks like from the color of the material that they probably printed the whole kit in PLA or ABS, which is frankly not too shabby because these low temperature materials are super easy to print and they keep costs way down compared to traditional manufacturing methods. Now, 3D printing in the automotive and racing world is pretty much here to stay. We've covered numerous stories on applications from printing jigs and fixtures for assembly lines, carbon fiber nylon parts going into Formula One cars, and even 3D printed pistons. Even some of our customers are using 3D printing to improve their products or even making new products like intake manifolds. Shout out to the guys over at Data Driven Performance. Very cool stuff coming out of that shop. Through additive manufacturing, teams and companies around the world can create prototypes quicker, cut down lead times on low volume production parts, and even improve existing designs through weight reduction design implementations that simply aren't possible in traditional subtractive manufacturing methods. Now you can watch the full video of the body kit build on his YouTube channel, which we've linked down below in the description, and also feel free to check out our 3D printing in motorsports video, which is also linked down below. Make sure to hit that like button while you're at it and subscribe so you don't miss the next video. Until then, have a positive rest of your day. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.